Hey, Patricia, I think it's about time we do something about that odor, especially when people are trying to eat. I think it's funny how Mr. Puny Palms have so much to say now that Pride is back, but you was all cramped up in that room with depression when he was gone. You better shut up. Does it really make you feel good to be rotten like that? Like, you know, rotten stuff. That's why you smell like that. <gasps> oh my god, it makes so much sense now. All right, y'all, I'm not just going to sit here and let y'all gang up on Patricia like that. Y'all can just relax a little bit. Grandma, did she hypnotize you again? I know, I'm thinking the same thing. We got to keep our eyes on her. No, I'm not hypnotized. Well, at least I don't think so. I just know that you have to be fair. And I can't sit there and let y'all gang up on her and just watch y'all do it. It's just, I'm, I'm not with it. Yes, and especially because Protestant with those premature pointers. What don't you get about it? You need to not roast them either. Or else I'm gonna just let them attack you. I mean, I really don't care. I'm not worried about them, Protestant. Like, what is you talking about? All right, y'all, get her. Patricia, you can't keep a man because nobody wants to dive into sewage. All right, all I'm gonna say is crab cake crawfish queen. She's the CEO of the crab house. First and foremost, none of y'all don't really know what a real woman smell like. That's why y'all always talking about my smells. Y'all got dried up ramen noodle looking here chicken flavor. Never seen none of y'all with a girlfriend. I, well, we already know Pride Gay, but Protestant, you look like you on your way. And your body is giving borderline bulimia. Uh, I know you're not trying to throw blows about the body. Look how bony you are and you got a whole boulder on the back of it, but I swear it's like two sacks of potatoes. You're such a messy person. That's why your hair resembles a mop. And I smelt several real women before and they never smelt like ranch. Or ranch. I'm too scared to wonder what type of critters are in her pants. All the people online think her name is Patricia instead of Perdicia, so I'm gonna start calling her Patty. And since she has crabs, we're gonna call her Krabby Patty. Because she always itching down there. And then, all right, y'all need to really shut up. I swear to God, like, this is why I hate y'all. Like, this is. See, now, Perdicia, relax. This is exactly why I said stop roasting, because you don't know how to handle it. As soon as they start digging in your. Mm, you just always. You, you gotta stop being such a poor sport, baby. Okay, this time I'm calling a rap battle and I'm eating all of y'all up. Oh, no, don't do it, don't do it. I never met a woman that was so pressed to compete with people more than she is to clean herself. Oh, y'all want to go. I don't know who I'm going to do first. Y'all just really want to be dead in the hearse. Y'all peons know I'm the best and y'all look like the worst. Fashion on fleek, got pride wanting to steal my purse. All right, can you stop? Like, your flow is trash. Like, <laughs> everything is just trash. Like, trash, 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 trash. And that's exactly what it smells like in here. Well, that's only because Perdition is in here. Or maybe because... Because it's you walking around with a damn dookie diaper. You better get out my face. You always telling somebody to get out your face. But that's the last thing that I'm in. I would never be that close to you. I can't get that close to you or my skin will melt. Oh yeah, definitely melt those little hands right up. Them little elastic, plastic, stiff hands that you got. Well, let's not talk about that little rocky, blocky, stiff booty you have. But still, y'all always talking about it. Like, dang, like, I don't want none of y'all. Y'all like, and, and you, you think, think we, we want, want you? you? You know what? Goodbye, gay boys. Thank poison. Bro, can you teach me how to sing like you? I could do my best, but it's going to take a lot of practice and belief coming from both ends, me and you. Well, I already think I can sing. I think I have a good voice, but I don't sound like you. Well, of course you don't sound like me. You don't have as much bass. Your Adam's apple ain't formed yet. Wait, what's an Adam's apple? Okay, so you know the apple that's on the back of the iPhones and stuff? You see how it's missing a bite out of it? Every man had to bite that apple, and then it was a piece of that apple that got stuck in their throat and that's what makes their voice so deep oh my god wow pride you're such a genius i never thought of that before well good don't ever think about it like that again because i was just playing uh, adam's apple is just a piece of cartilage that sticks out in the throat of men so, or sometimes women too pride what is cartilage all right now i ain't say i was taking you to school if you want to learn about all this stuff you can find it on the internet just go to google see this is why you're a genius i never thought of that but i did think of that and i think you knew i thought of that so that's why you're a genius my body, my body, my body, yeah. Yikes. <laughs> we got a lot more work to do. See, this is what I mean. I can't sing like you. Protestant, calm down. <laughs> we only been doing this for like five, ten minutes. Relax. I know, but I just want to be great. Well, it takes time to be great. Every person that you know that you see as great took time to build their craft. And you got to do the same thing, man. It ain't no shortcuts. But now you're lying to me because there is shortcuts. I see people take shortcuts every day. All right, well, let me just tweak my wording a little bit. When I say it ain't no shortcuts, I mean, pretty much, if you try to take shortcuts throughout your entire life, you're always going to get cut short. So put in the work that you need to put in so that you can really be great and hold on to your greatness. I feel like we need to keep a tithing bucket going around because you always preach it. Period. Okay, now go. My, my, my heart and my body, yeah. My, my, my heart and my body, yeah.
I'm so happy she's outside doing that dance because the house would be so stink. But now the saddest part is that she's polluting our environment. Oh my god, we just can't win with Perdisha. A is for All right now. B is for Baby, have some of this mothball casserole. C is for Casserole with mothballs in it. D is for Don't play with me. D is for Eat every last bit of it. F is for Finish that mothball casserole so I can give you some more. A is for Antoine, I'm gonna need you to stop doing it. B is for Boy, bye. If you ain't got a bag, bounce. C is for Can you stop staring at me? D is for Did you not hear what I just said? E is for Enifrius, duh. F is for For real? Y'all need to mind your business. A is for Adam's apple. Pride taught me that. B is for Bath, Perdition, B-A-T-H. Sorry. C is for Can't eat that mothball casserole, Grandma. Sorry. D is for Dang, Perdition. That's a lot of boyfriends. E is for Enter into my kingdom. F is for fish, 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 fish. A is for Are you wearing my shoes, Perdition? B is for Bandanas don't mean I'm gang affiliated. C is for Casserole should not have mothballs in it. D is for Don't get mad at me because you wearing my shoes. E is for Everything is love. F is for Forget what I just said. A is for All these kids in this house disrespectful. B is for bad and ungrateful kids. That's all I can think about. C is for come and get custody of these kids. D is for dish is never clean. You ain't take out the trash. I can't stand. E is for expensive. All the food I gotta buy for y'all to close. F is for fathers needed. Dad, will you push me on the swing? Yeah, but we're gonna go back in the house in like 15 minutes. We just got out here like five minutes ago. Or at least it feels that way. Wait, Pratt, isn't that your old middle school teacher? That is Miss Wharton Abrosia. How do you remember her? Well, you can stop gawking all over it. And used to cut out pictures from the yearbook and put it... Okay, okay, I get it. You want to go over there and talk to him? Yeah, because if I'm not mistaken, I see a little girl over there. Hi, Ray Ray. Wow, you've grown so tall. Yeah, I'm a grown man now. I think Pratt has a crush on you, miss. And I have a crush on her. You're not in my age range. How you know? And age ain't nothing but a number. You listen to R. Kelly? No, no, no. Not in our household. Well, do you think I'll be able to come to your house? You don't even know us. How would your mom feel about that? Um, see, that's the thing. I don't think my mom has feelings about us. She doesn't care. She's never at home, and she's always chasing after a man. Girl, they is not ready for us. We about to cut up in the city. We show sure Liz. What you want to do first? Girl, well, first things first, I want to eat because I can never get nothing to eat by myself while I'm at the house with them kids. They always asking for stuff, but I love them. Those are my grandbabies. Oh, I think the thing not, we came here to cut up and eat, not talk about your grandchildren. Period, poo. You are so right. It's so hard for me to get out of grandma mode, especially when they got a deadbeat mother. She dead? Oh, I'm sorry. I said she's a deadbeat. She eat beets. You so ready to turn up. You forgot to turn up your damn hearing aid. But I heard that clear as day. Of course it is, because you got that selective hearing. You only like to hear what you want to hear. Girl, don't try to check me. What do you want to drink? See, you so worried about my fluids. Get the fluids out your ears. I worry about my drinks. Oh, you a feisty little bit. Girl, don't act like you forgot. You remember how I used to do you in them arm wrestles? Girl, I'm stronger now. I be slamming these little kids left and right on their necks. Well, you ain't talking to a little kid. Let's see what you got. Uh-uh, let's wait till we get back to your house. Oh, girl, you scared. Can we go get tans? A tan? What you want a tan for, man? We black. I mean, we brown, but... I just want a tan because everybody keeps picking on the color of my hands. Well, the people that's picking on the color of your hands are racist. And guess what? You look better than racist people. Racism is ugly. Well, some people tell me that I don't know if I want to be white or if I'm trying to be black. And I know that I'm black. It's just my hands are pale. Sweetie, your hands are more than pale. They stiff and they little. Chill, Perdisha. He really dealing with something right now. We wouldn't do that to you. What you mean, chill? Y'all do it to me all the time. I'm always dealing with stuff. I be going through my depression and all that stuff, and y'all still be cracking on me. That's a lie, Perdisha. Nobody even bothers you. We always talk about you when you start talking about us or when you come down with that stinky aroma. Exactly. So why is y'all always talking about my smells? The only reason we talk about them is so that you can hopefully change them. But clearly, that ain't working. Well, picking on me definitely 
luckily don't make me want to change my smells. Well, if you would change your smells, you wouldn't get picked on so much. And if you wasn't so toxic, then you wouldn't smell like that. Alright, so now that we back at my place, let's get straight to it. Don't you think we should drink some milk or something, get our bones up? Girl, I already got strong bones. I don't know about you, you might be brittle. I'm brittle, but your arm is so little. But it's tougher than a riddle, so don't play with me, let's get it. Now put your arm right there. Don't be holding on to the table cheating and stuff. Oh, I ain't gotta cheat, cause you finna get beat. And if I win, you'll eat sweets off my feet. Oh wait, but what if I win? My friend, you won't. Oh my effing God, this house is reeking of old people. Uh, oh, you trying to start a conversation? I think she only trying to talk because you in here with me, Taji. I don't know why, because we don't want them. And you think I want you? I was up in here trying to bless y'all with my presence. Y'all got me effed up. But this is the thing, Patricia. Every time you want to talk about something, it's always negative. Why is this baby dwarf talking to me with these stiff hands? I said stay in a child's place on several occasions. Well, if I got to stay in a child's place, you need to stay in a pescatarian's place at the fish market. Damn! Damn. Oh my god, I can't believe I made Perdisha cry just now. Or it might have just been her onion armpits. Honestly, you getting mad ruthless with your words, Protestant. You ain't got no filter, no cap. Well, should I have a filter or no? Yes, everybody should have a filter, but you still have the right to say what you want to say. You just got to know how to deliver it in a better way sometimes. Like, I'm not saying what you did to Perdisha was wrong, because she needed that with her steak itself. Oh, okay. I just thought you were making me feel bad about what I said to Perdisha. Anyway, I want to go down there and see what Grandma's doing. She went out to the mall and stuff today without us. <laughs> You're a little stronger than I remember. Are you holding on to the table? I can ask you the same thing. Wait, they're arm wrestling? Who do you think is going to win? Well, you know I got my money on Grandma Pride. She don't play. And I got my money on Grandma Twerks a lot. I don't know who I got my money on. Well, I don't even have money, but... Oh, the ambulance! No! A is for almost time for my nap. B is for bodacious, beautiful pride of me. C is for <laughs> D is for dang, I'm up, I'm up. E is for everybody always think I'm sleep when I'm woke. F is for forget this, I'm tired. A is for Ain't raising no gay son. B is for Boys shouldn't be dating boys and they need to be playing football. C is for Children? What about them? I don't raise them. D is for Dads don't have to raise kids. That's why they don't carry them. E is for Every woman needs a strong man to protect them and eat up all the food. F is for Refrigerator cannot be empty if you expect me to be your man. So get rid of some of them kids. Your grandma proud and Miss Twix a lot broke their arms arm wrestling. <laughs> Man, what you come up here telling me for? Like, am I supposed to give any sort of care? Well, I mean, you should if you're really a civilized human being. Well, we already know that you're not. But the only reason I came up here to tell you is because there's no one else to talk to. Pride and Taiji went to the hospital with them. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. And why didn't they take you? I know they did not just leave you here with me. This is not a baby daycare center. What you mean it's not a baby daycare center? I don't need you to take care of me. You can't even take care of yourself. Boy, you better pipe all the way down because it ain't nobody here to protect you. I will put a plastic bag over your head. You know what? I might take you up on that offer because then you'll go to jail. And then that way you can stop killing people with your horrible toxic smells. I'm not scared of you, Perdisha. Well. Oh, you ought to be scared because you really don't know what I'm capable of. Yeah, you're really capable of destroying someone's day. You know what? Why am I wasting my time with you? Let me go help Grandma look for her bat because she lost it yesterday. Wait, Prada May lost her bat? That's probably why she broke her arm. She must be feeling weak without it. Ooh, I got a plan. 